Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Zade Blade Plays. So, last episode we went to the nether and got a few things. Um, we do need to get some smooth stone once it is day. It's almost day. Um, so anyway, I found online, as far as I can tell, the only thing that's going to corrupt my animals is, um, not grinding netherrack, but releasing netherrack through, um, a hopper and soul sand. So, I'm not gonna do that here. Because you actually need to have something to catch them. Uh, but I need, yeah, I need to be able to get to the, f the point of making urns. But you can't actually make urns until you've made um, hellfire dust. And, you, and to make hellfire dust, you, have to, you actually have to release. <laughs> I almost knocked my water over. Okay, I almost knocked my water off there. Um, and my daughter came in <laughs> to ask about a movie. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so it's kind of an, an interesting thing because you need to have the um, hellfire dust in order to make the ability for you to create pottery. So you're going to have to release souls. There's just nothing, uh, nothing else to say about that. You have to release souls now. <laughs> That's just part of the progression. Why can't I? Oh. I'm pressing E like it's uh, seven days to die. <laughs> uh, that's the thing, like progression, right? Um, anyway, so we have to make ourselves some... Where did I put all my... Ah, here it is, okay. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, so you have to do it. So what I'm going to do is do it far away. Now, I know that ghasts don't get released anymore. So that's, I guess, a, a benefit to doing it. Ghasts will not be released anymore. Um, they used to get released and they're a pain at this stage of your development because you can't really handle them now. But they're great later on because you can actually farm gas tears. So, anyway, there we go. What the crap? Whoa, holy cow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that normal? How close do I have to be for that to happen? Right there. Holy crap. Does that mess with my pigs? Oh my word. We're gonna have to create a separate grinding area. Holy crap. Alright. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. We're gonna stand over here for a little bit. Holy crap. I have a nausea. Alright, so my guess is that, um... The sound creates you... Creates you to be nauseated. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Holy cow. Whoa, whoa. That, that's gonna make me vomit, guys. Holy crap. Okay, now the other thing that I want to use the um, Hellfire Dust for, besides making uh, at least one, what are they called? Uh, hibachi. Besides making one Hibachi, um, I want to use it to, uh, man, I need to, I need to get stone. How am I going to get stone if that thing's going like that? Can I be over here to get stone? Is that going to, okay, I'm far enough away. Yeah, so um, anyway. Uh, I'm going to make one hibachi, but the other thing that I want to get is, um, what's this stuff called? Uh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nether coal, right? So nether coal is totally a thing, and it's the one type of, oh, shoot, it's the one type of coal that won't go out. As far as I'm aware, I think those are regular torches now. Um, I'm wondering if I still have to light them. I'm not sure if I do. It would make sense if I still had to light them. Whoa. Dude, go away. <laughs> it would make sense if I still had to light them. Is he getting mad at me? I'm just hoping he's not getting ticked off at me for, like, making him vomit. <laughs> he could be. I don't even know, right? Oh, shoot. Okay, I've got to get that one, too. Yeah, so I don't think it's affecting the, um, the animals. Uh, at least it hasn't been. They, they don't seem to be messing around or being upset. Um, and I read online that it's whenever a soul is, well, doing things to release souls. And grinding netherrack does not release souls. Um, it only uh, grinds them. You release them, 
upon putting them through soul sand filter. That's when they get released. So my guess is that uh, when you do a soul sand grind, what is this thing doing? Is it affecting him? Like, is he getting all weeded out because of the grinding? That would be hilarious if that were so. Yeah, so it's only releasing them that's going to cause this issue. So we should be fine. Hopefully. We shouldn't have any issues. Hopefully. Um, I could be wrong, and I would regret being wrong, but just from reading all the comments, it seems that it's only um, when people have released souls near their animals that there's been an issue with the animals becoming corrupted. So I'm going to take their word for it, and I'm just going to take the chance. Um, I don't think FC would do that to us. Like, I know he likes to, you know, watch us suffer, but I think that's, I think that's one step too far for him. Because it doesn't make sense, because they're not actually being released. He said released. So, if I have to get a whole bunch of new pigs and stuff, I'm fully okay with that. I have, I have made my choice, and, um, if I have to live with the consequences, I'll live with the consequences. But I'm pretty certain. I wouldn't have done it unless I was certain. Alright, how many of these do we have? Oh, good. Okay, we have enough. So I need to create a timing uh, scheme for the um, for the bellows. I need to create a bellows. Um, yeah, there's a couple things we need to create, but we're going to try to get to the stage of pottery, um, if at all possible. Is this still grinding? Yep, go away. Okay, um, I guess, what else do I need this for? Oh, I need this for hibachis too. Okay, I'm just going to uh, grab some more uh, smooth stone while I'm waiting for that stuff to finish grinding. And I'll meet you guys back here in a little bit. All right, guys, so um, well, let me just lower this volume here for a second. There we go. Anyway, so um, I got my uh, ground nether rack. Is this still going? Yeah, okay, I just couldn't hear. And right now I'm actually grinding um, my coal because besides making these things here, now I think it's eight, yeah. It's eight per each of the bricks that we need to have. Uh, now there's another, um, so it's 24 that we need of these in order to make the right, oops, that's wrong. The other cool thing is now that we have netherrack, we can actually use this ground netherrack to make netherrack sludge, which you can use as mortar. So that is cool, I'll just show you real quick. Stick one of those things in there, is that right? Okay, I'm wrong. That does not do anything. Oh, shoot. There we go. We need 24. So we're going to take those 24, and we're going to use those once they are turned into um, uh, Hellfire Dust. We're going to make those be the the uh, first one of our hibachis, um, which will be cool, which will be great. And then we're going to use the rest of it, 27 of it, to make um, nether coal. And you get two nether coal each so it does double um, it's not like it used to be where it quadrupled but it's okay we get two for the price of one and also I don't believe they go out in rain I don't believe they're I think they always stay on which would make sense because you know it's made from netherrack which never goes out unless it's rained on but that would suck if you can't actually create light in the world with torches um, I hope that's not the case anyway guys um, I'm gonna let this stuff grind and I'll be right back Alrighty, guys, it is raining. Like, talk about bad luck. It is raining when I want to do this particular thing. Now, just make sure there's nothing about to come out and kill me. We are going to be going far enough away so that we don't accidentally give any souls <laughs> to our piggies. Or anything else, for that matter. So we're going to come way over here. I think that is plenty far away. I can't even hear them anymore. And we're going to come over here. We're going to set this guy down. Now, we can only do a certain amount at a time before this thing breaks. So, we need to keep an eye on that. Uh, we want 24. Oops. Now, I believe it's going to be 8 and this thing breaks. So, let's try 6 first and see what happens. Beautiful. Now, we're... Oh, shoot. I forgot to bring my axe. All right. Whoa. Did I just... Oh, I slowed down because I had shift. Right, I'll be right back. I'm just going to go get um, the other things that I should have brought with me. Um, 
mainly my axe, to be able to break that thing without it dying. So, be right back. Alright, I have my axe now. So, the reason why we have to keep breaking this thing down is because it keeps track of how many times you've thrown a, um... Uh... Um... Uh... Nether... What is this stuff called? Ground netherrack on it. So, we have to be very careful not to exceed the limit. So, we're just going to check another six on there. Beautiful. Break it. And we're going to do it again. Um, I just don't want it to break. That just costs too much. Okay, so we have another six. Awesome. Now, I could power this with my windmill, but it would just be just a pain to set up all the way over here for no reason. Uh, just to get these first. There we go. Now, now that we've done this, we can actually create soul urns to be able to capture those souls. I kind of wish we had this done before we found that village because we would be able to convert some of those villagers. And there was actually a priest villager there. And we killed him. So that does suck big time. But there's nothing we can do about that. Man, I need a hat, don't I? Alright, so we've got our hellfire dust. We have 24. Gonna chuck that on there, and it should make some beautiful things for us. Oh, wait, no. Whoa. That was close. Right, so we need this concentrated hellfire, and we need three of them, which we'll get three. It's each eight will give you one. And once we have this, we will be able... Actually, let's get one more thing. Uh, here we go. And here we go. Okay, ready, guys? Here we go. We are going to create our first hibachi. I don't know how these work with the new fire settings, so hopefully it's not bad. Alright, let's see. Bam! Hibachi right there. There we go. We got a hibachi. And the other thing we need to make involves four gold. There we go. And we need to surround this like... Oh, shoot. We need, we need to actually this. We need to make a clock. Uh, oh, actually, we need... A couple of other things, too. Um, where... Alright, we'll put you guys in there for now. I need one of you. There we go. And do we have... We do, okay. So, we're going to first make the clock. Like so. Um, and then... Ooh, that's a really cool looking clock. I think that's been updated. I don't think that's the original one that we used to have. And then we need to have one, two, three of these guys. Clock... And smooth stone. There we go. Turntable. Okay. Now this is going to be a little bit difficult because we don't have enough gold to make um, another gearbox. So we're going to have to... Oh, actually, we can't, can we? We need to get more gold. We need more gold. Dang it. Okay. Here's what we're going to do, though. Before we go trudging down into the depths, we are going to grind up some more netherrack. Um, where are we going to put this thing? I think we'll probably put it right here. That would be my thinking. Where's my pickaxe? There she is. That would be my thinking. Put it right here. Sorry about that, children. I've got lots of them, and there's really nowhere to get away from them at the moment. So I'm going to take some of this iron, and I know I don't really want to do this. I'd really rather make... I should have made this diamond axe. Not a diamond axe. I should have made it a diamond shovel. I have a saw now. I don't actually need an axe. I'm just so used to making them. I know. I know. You guys are probably screaming at me um, in the last episode, which has already been up now, so I didn't see any comments about it, but I'm sure someone's going to comment. I should have made a shovel. And yes, you are right. I should have made a shovel. I could have made two shovels. Or even a, a sword, for that matter, because I could use it as a weapon. I didn't do that. Shame on me. Alright, so anyway. Um, I'm thinking about putting the hibachis right next door to this. I don't think it's going to cause... I'm not... I don't think it, I don't think it's going to cause any issues. Uh, man, I do need an iron shovel. Do I have one that's... Are all my iron shovels completely gone? <sighs> Alright. Oh my word, it's like a revolving door. <laughs> okay. Anyway. I lost my train of thought. Um, my daughter asked me to come in and open up a, a bag of chips for her. A little bag of chips, not a big one. Alright, so, uh, I don't think this is going to affect anything. I need to make myself a shovel. 
I wish I didn't have to. I don't really need to make anything else right now, so that's why I'm going to make a shovel. I have I have enough iron. Oh, come on, go over here, dude. I have enough iron to uh, to not really worry about it at this stage. And plus, I'm going to be able to remelt this stuff just momentarily. Oh, look at that. Coal. Cool. Do I not have room for it? I don't. Let's put you away. I don't need you right now. There we go. Yeah, the other thing I want to talk about, there is a new update. I'm not too certain about it. You guys know me in updates. I, I don't like doing them. <laughs> um, there's some things that I don't like in it. And I know you're going to say, just bite the bullet. You're going to have to do it anyway. You can't just not do it. I could just not do it, actually, guys. I could. I could actually literally just not do it. Um, if I wanted to. <sighs> and I don't really want to do it. I really don't want to do it. Man, I gotta... I'm gonna shove some things in here really quick. Where am I... Where can I put some of this stuff? Alright, I'm gonna do some inventory management and I'll be right back. Alright, so, um... Yeah. I don't really want to use my stone. <laughs> Maybe when I get more stone, we'll do that. But right now, I guess I'll just make... A redstone torch rather than a switch. I usually always make um, levers because they're so much easier to do, but in this case, nah. I'll just have to uh, do it this way. Bam. So I can't control whether it's, <clears throat> excuse me, on or off, but that's okay. It's perfectly okay. There we go. So we have our first do. Oh, actually, shoot. Um, let's put that there. What we need to do first is we need to take our loose blocks here and do we have any other oh yeah we have these nether rack bricks i like the i like the fact that everything in the nether seems to be solid now like i mean it's the only place where you can actually get blocks that are just always solid all right let's see here we need to place him there and actually we need to place these by him because we need to make the same uh, thing here. Oh, but it's gonna it's gonna take that block, isn't it? That's a roof. Should I bring it down? Yeah, I'll bring it. Should I bring it down one level? Things are gonna be up there. I could. Yeah, let's bring it down a level. Oh shoot. Well, at least I got it back. <laughs> that was a bit of a worry there for a second. I thought I wasn't gonna get it all back. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll bring this down one more level. Like this. Okay. And we will put this guy right here. That there. And place um, this guy on top of him. Then we'll place him. And then we'll place these two guys here. And him there. Him there him there. Okay, now, the other thing we need to do is grab ourselves some clay, because we're going to make this into the actual bricks. And we need one more on this side to do this. Oh, shoot. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to put it behind it. It works better if you put it back here, so let's uh, break you. And you. Hopefully I got... I did get eight back. Okay, that's nice. It's nice that there's no loss. It's a really pain if you have to lose stuff to make this stuff. Like, just moving it around sort of thing. Oh, but I am using a diamond pick. That's probably why it's lossless. There we go. Okay. There. What the crap? Oh, shoot. I didn't actually make that <laughs> Oh. Oh, it's stuck because of that. There we go. Okay, and then we break that. And there we go. Now we have something we can actually work with here. And it's bright enough here where I don't have to worry about things spawning, luckily. Well, thankfully. Alright, so. Um, I don't believe we can actually use this to cook iron anymore, but that's fine. We're going to have everything else right next to it here, one level lower. Oh, but that's going to be a pain with that, isn't it? It is. It's going to be a pain. So what I, what I think we'll do is we'll just build a wall here, All right? And so, shoot.
That's not gonna work either. Uh. Oh well, we'll have to leave it like this for now. Um, let's go make ourselves a blower up thing. Bellows. I'll be right back as soon as I got this stuff. We have a problem. I have three scoured leather, but only two dung. We need to go out and find a dog. So we'll have to do that tomorrow. We don't have time today. So we'll just put those in there with that. Get the sugar out just in case. And, uh, yeah, we're going to get some more poop. We can't make a bellows without it because we need three tanned hide. And we only have two after this. So, And I'm going to I'm gonna make this the way you guys have suggested. I'm going to put this to be a full block. And um, just hope nothing spawns in here. I guess. Uh, yeah. I hope the dog poops. So, anyway. Um, I'm going to have to go find a dog in the morning. So, I'll see you guys in the morning. We'll go on a little adventure. Cheers, guys.